Hello YouTube, this is KE0OJE. I thought I'd show you all a small portable go kit I recently put together. I originally got the idea from a video titled MCOM slash Portable Dual Band Ham Pack. I put a link in the description. If you haven't seen it, you might want to check it out. I was looking for an all-in-one kit that I could just grab on my way out the door if needed for any portable situation. And I really like the looks of his setup, but I wanted a little more battery power than the 7 amp hour in his kit. I chose a 12 amp hour sealed lead acid battery with a uh, topper called Batmon from Harden Power Systems. This gave me an additional 5 amp hours plus two USB ports right on the topper that I don't have to find a place for somewhere else in this small case. It also has a nice voltmeter you can turn on whenever you want to check the uh, charge level of your battery. I chose the Lexan 898E because of its small size, great reviews, and it has three power settings, 5, 10, and 25 watts. I've gotten really great signal reports both through repeaters and simplex with it. And I ran the battery cables uh, from the radio up through an Anderson power pole pod mount that I got from qsradio.com. Of course you can get those from several different places. And I keep a jumper in my little storage space and just pull it out when I'm ready to set up. The battery topper has a fused side that you use when you're hooking up the radio just for a little added protection. And then there's also the unfused side that you would hook up to your charger when your battery needs to be charged. The mic fits in here as well, and I just fish it out when I'm ready to talk. Hook up the antenna. Extend it to its full height of about a couple of feet. And I'm ready for any MCOM or portable radio situation. KE0 OJE listening. The whole kit weighs about 15 pounds and the parts cost right at $420. It took me about two days to decide on a layout, make a template to cut the holes in the plexiglass with, and hook everything up. It was a really fun project and I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, just let me know and I'll do my best to answer. Thanks for watching.